Hey guys, just wanted to share with you this uh, little project that I've made uh, before I'm gonna glue everything uh, in place and then it will be fastened. Um, it's a signal generator. I've purchased it off eBay about three months ago and it arrived about two months ago and uh, all the rest of the time to get this whole result um, up until now. Um, I purchased it initially um, so that I have a, a, a clock that I can use on the Z80 computer and just rev it up from 1 hertz up to a few megahertz and uh, this, uh, this unit uh, serves the purpose. It came as a kit, it cost me um, I think 9 euros and it was a nice kit to make, you can see photos here on the side um, showing the build and the testing and just seeing that it works and does everything. Um, other than that, there is this little circuit that I've made, which is, um, as you can see, this unit needs 5 volt, 12, minus 12, and uh, ground. So here I have uh, the 5 volt regulator, and uh, this is a DC-DC converter, which will convert from positive voltage to negative voltage, and uh, all that just so that I can connect it um, to a 12 volt supply and uh, I don't need to have all these wires in between which I'm going to show you just the menu because I don't have the oscilloscope on this table but you saw it in the in the videos here on the side just going to share with you the the menu that you get so um, we get a sine uh, wave uh, we get a square triangle you can play with uh, with uh, with the speed Sawtooth, reverse, sawtooth, ECG, uh, the frequency step so we can increase it from uh, 1 to 10,000. Um, just random noise and this is the high speed which comes out of this output and uh, it goes up to 8 megahertz like that and um, yeah that's the unit. Um, other than that, uh, as you can see, I made a small housing for it, just so that I don't need to, to touch um, the circuit and uh, while, while it's operating and interfere it or anything like that. And it will come like this, I'm going to fasten it all into place now. I've made this little panel which fits like that. Not the straightest thing, add a bit of a glitch here with this hole but uh, it all works fine I have buttons for it which I've salvaged out of a printer once and some screws that I found which will fit it all in place and that's it that's my uh, my clock for the computer once it will be um, ev everything will be done the whole series and then I can play around with it and I can just take it from one hertz up to a few megahertz and sort of track uh, the level that it functions and how it operates and everything uh, to show for demonstrational purposes. Um, hope you liked it and if you're considering buying one of these then uh, you're buying a good product. Uh, it's definitely not some fancy signal generator that costs uh, a few um, hundred dollars but um, for my purpose, it does the job and I'm satisfied for that 9 euro. So thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.